Watch your breath coming in, going out. You're staying with the force of life. If it weren't for the breath, you and you and the body would be in different places. It's because of the breath that we're aware of the body. It's breath because of the breath we can use the body. So it's really important that we get in touch with this, because all of our other actions go through the breath element. This is one of the reasons why the Buddha has us focus our attention here. If you're going to be breaking a precept, you have to do it through the breath element. If you're going to be behaving in a skillful way, it's through the breath element. So when you're right here, you're right at the checkpoint. Impulses coming in from the body into the mind, you meet them right here. The orders that the mind gives for the body to do this or do that, they're going to come through right here. So this is a really good place where you can exercise restraint. In other words, deciding what you're going to focus on, what you're not going to focus on, how you're going to focus on it. Restraint doesn't mean just not looking or not listening to things. It means looking in a way or listening in a way that does not give rise to greed, aversion, and delusion. And so when you're with the breath, you're in a good place to do this. The same way with the orders that you give, to do things, say things. You can exercise restraint by being right here to see, okay, if this action is going to cause harm, you, why do you want to do it? The Buddha talks about restraint and needing to have a firm post. The same way that you tie six different animals to a leash. If there's no post for them to be tied to, then they pull each other in different directions. But if there's a firm post that the leashes are all tied to, okay, then, then there's no problem. They all stay right there. So this is a good place to watch over what you're doing and saying and thinking, watching over the things that you're letting inside and how you're letting them inside. When you're going out to look at something, what's your purpose in looking? It's going to go whizzing past right here. So try to stay right here as much as you can, because this is the best place to see what's going on and to exercise some restraint so that what's going on is more and more inclined to bring the mind to peace. and then bring your actions into the area of what's skillful.